Unscrew the reservoir cap. Screw the air pump to the reservoir valve. Do not enable the valve duct. Pressurize the air pump at 200 psi. Enable the valve duct and the pressure in the pump will be normalized with the pressure inside the reservoir. Ensure the pressure is between 10 and 12 bars. If the pressure is correct, close the pump valve duct and remove the pump. Screw the reservoir cap. This procedure shows what happens if the pressure inside the reservoir is unchecked properly. The reservoir pressure is correct at first. As you can see there's a lower pressure than before. This happens because a portion of nitrogen inside the reservoir gets lost in the hose between the valve and the manometer. The nitrogen loss increases with lengthy air pump hoses. After a few pressure checks, the reservoir lost a lot of nitrogen despite there being no leaks on the shock absorber. Ensure you follow the right procedure to avoid any issues.